Nature has a way of surprising us with its incredible creativity. And in this video, we're taking a closer look at the astonishing and unusual weather events that continue to leave scientists and meteorologists in awe. Number 1. Halboobs These are intense dust storms that occur in arid regions like the Sahara Desert and the southwestern United States. Half boobs are sometimes humorously referred to as dust walls of doom due to their dramatic and intimidating appearance as they approach. Some half boobs can be truly massive, with towering walls of dust that can reach heights of 1,500 to 3,000 feet and stretch for dozens of miles. Half boobs often carry not only dust and sand, but also a variety of allergens, pollutants, and even microbes from the surface they pass over. These dust storms can transport particles from deserts to far-reaching locations, affecting air quality and potentially causing health issues for people who are exposed to the airborne particles. High boobs can lead to stunning and vibrant sunsets as the dust particles scatter and filter sunlight, creating a range of warm colours in the evening sky. Number 2. Ball Lightning Ball lightning typically appears as a spherical, glowing and self-contained ball of light, often ranging in size from a golf ball to a basketball. Unlike typical lightning, which lasts only for a fraction of a second, ball lightning can persist for several seconds or even minutes. Ball lightning exhibits unpredictable and bizarre behaviour. It can move erratically, pass through solid objects and even explode without warning. Ball lightning is relatively rare and unpredictable. It's often observed during or after thunderstorms. It has been reported indoors, such as within homes and aircraft, as well as outdoors, adding to its enigmatic nature. Ball lightning remains one of the most perplexing and unexplained natural phenomena, and its rarity and unpredictability continue to intrigue both scientists and enthusiasts. Number 3. Kelvin Helmholtz Clouds Kelvin Helmholtz Clouds have a distinct wave-like appearance, resembling a series of rolling or curling cloud layers. They often look like ocean waves in the sky. These clouds are named after Lord Kelvin and Hermann von Helmholtz, who independently studied the physics behind the formation of these cloud patterns. Kelvin Helmholtz Clouds form as a result of atmospheric instability, typically when two adjacent air layers have different densities and wind velocities. The contrast between these layers leads to the characteristic rolling cloud pattern. These cloud patterns are often short-lived and can change rapidly, making them a relatively uncommon sight in the sky. Similar wave-like cloud patterns resembling Kelvin Helmholtz clouds have been observed on other planets, including Jupiter and Saturn. Observing Kelvin Helmholtz clouds in the sky is a treat for cloud enthusiasts and meteorology enthusiasts, and they serve as a visual reminder of the complex dynamics of the atmosphere. Number 4. Thunder Snow Thunder snow is essentially a thunderstorm that occurs during snowfall, which is quite rare because thunderstorms are more commonly associated with rain. Thunder snow is often accompanied by heavy snowfall rates which can lead to rapid accumulation of snow. Unlike thunder associated with traditional thunderstorms, the thunder during thunder snow is typically quieter and more muffled due to the sound dampening effect of falling snowflakes. In some rare cases, thunder snow has been associated with the formation of winter tornadoes. These tornadoes are much weaker than their warm season counterparts but can still cause damage. In few cases, Thunder snow can lead to the formation of winter water spouts over bodies of water. These are tornado-like columns of rotating snow or ice. The lightning in thunder snow can be particularly vivid and intense, providing a stunning visual display when it occurs during the night time. Number 5. Morning glory clouds. Morning glory clouds are considered a rare meteorological phenomenon and are not commonly observed in most regions. They are most reliably seen in the Gulf of Carpentaria. These clouds have a very distinctive appearance, resembling long, rolling and tubular cloud formations that can stretch for hundreds of kilometers. 
In some parts of Australia, enthusiasts engage in cloud surfing by gliding or soaring within the morning glory cloud formations. This unique experience draws both meteorologists and extreme sports enthusiasts. Certain locations, such as Burketown in Queensland, Australia, have become popular for viewing morning glory clouds due to their proximity to the convergence zones where the clouds often form. Morning glory clouds are not only a meteorological wonder, but also a spectacle that has captivated the imagination of both scientists and cloud enthusiasts who seek to experience their unique and mesmerizing beauty. Number 6. Fire Tornadoes Fire tornadoes occur when a fire's intense heat creates rapidly rising air that starts to rotate, much like a tornado drawing in flames, ash and burning debris. This creates a towering column of fire. Fire tornadoes can vary greatly in size, from relatively small worlds to large, towering structures that can extend hundreds of feet into the air. These phenomena are typically associated with wildfires, especially those of significant intensity. The heat from the wildfire is a crucial factor in their formation. Fire tornadoes can have incredible rotation speeds, and some have been recorded spinning at over 140 miles per hour. While they can be intensely destructive, fire tornadoes are usually relatively short-lived, lasting from just a few minutes to around half an hour. Fire tornadoes are a terrifying and destructive force of nature, illustrating the power and danger of wildfires. Understanding their behaviour and mechanisms is vital for improving wildfire management and safety. Number 7. Lenticular clouds Lenticular clouds are named after their resemblance to smooth, lens-shaped or saucer-like structures. They often look like UFO or flying saucers. Lenticular clouds are generally stationary, appearing in the same location for extended periods. This stationary nature is due to wind patterns and atmospheric conditions that create the cloud shape. Lenticular clouds often form downwind of mountain ranges. In some instances, lenticular clouds can form as multiple layers, stacked on top of each other, creating a visually stunning effect. Lenticular clouds can exhibit vibrant colours at their edges, often appearing iridescent or rainbow-like, adding to their unique and eye-catching appearance. The presence of lenticular clouds indicates strong winds aloft, which can be advantageous for activities like gliding and paragliding. The striking appearance of lenticular clouds has inspired artists, photographers and writers, and they have been featured in numerous works of art literature, and popular culture. Number 8. Virgo Virgo often creates the illusion of rain or snow falling from the sky, only to disappear before making contact with the Earth's surface. This can give the impression of a ghostly or ephemeral rainfall. Virgo may not only involve rain, but snow, sleet or hail as well. Virgo formation is heavily influenced by temperature and humidity conditions. Dry air near the surface, or significant temperature differences aloft, can lead to the evaporation of falling precipitation. Virgo can be associated with microbursts and downdrafts, which are strong and potentially hazardous wind patterns near the surface. These phenomena can result from the cooling caused by the evaporation of Virgo. In desert regions, Virgo is a relatively common sight due to the arid climate. Rainfall often evaporates before reaching the ground, contributing to the perception of dryness. Virgo can have interesting visual effects during sunsets and sunrises. The evaporation of Virgo can scatter and refract sunlight, creating stunning and colorful atmospheric displays. Number 9. Catatumbo Lightning Located at the mouth of the Catatumbo River in Venezuela, this unique lightning phenomenon produces near-constant flashes of lightning for up to 10 hours a night, often over the same area. Catatumbo lightning holds the Guinness World Record for being the world's most prolific lightning generator. It produces an average of 250 lightning flashes per square kilometre per year, 
The presence of warm, moist air from the Caribbean Sea colliding with the cool air from the Andes Mountains creates ideal conditions for the formation of Catatumbo lightning. Historically, Catatumbo lightning has served as a navigational aid for sailors and early explorers in the region. It was sometimes referred to as the Lighthouse of Maracaibo. The lightning phenomenon also has environmental implication. It generates ozone at low altitudes and contributes to the removal of particulate pollutants from the atmosphere. Number 10. Penitence These are tall, thin blades of hardened snow or ice found at high altitudes, particularly in the Andes Mountains. They form through a process of sublimation, where snow and ice turn directly into water vapour. Penitents tend to align themselves in the direction of the prevailing winds. This alignment is often east to west because of the path of the sun's movement. The shape of penitents can be altered by the angle and direction of the sun's rays, which can sculpt their surfaces and contribute to their unique, blade-like appearance. Although penitents have been present in high-altitude regions for centuries, they were first described in scientific literature in the early 20th century. Features resembling penitents have been observed on other celestial bodies, including Pluto, where they are formed from methane and nitrogen ice. These uncommon weather phenomena showcase the fascinating and sometimes bizarre aspects of Earth's atmosphere and meteorological processes. And there you have it, another dose of the fascinating, the unexpected and the enlightening. We hope you enjoyed this journey through the world of random facts and intriguing knowledge. If you're hungry for more mind-boggling facts and curious tidbits, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join our community of curious minds. We're on a quest to keep you informed, engaged and entertained.